Hi guys, I'm here at the Temple of Heaven. Um, it's just the entrance because uh, the temples are not closed. There's supposed to be around four temples inside, and uh, unfortunately, kanina ko pa siya talaga hinahanap umaga. But I hope the God, the I hope the God will listen, naman, that I really search for it and. Um, I, I really wanted to see the temples here inside so what I'm saying is uh, it's one of the top destinations though and it's a must when you visit um, Beijing so uh, that's why I really strive to come here even if kanina sobrang ligaw ko na talaga <laughs> ilang oras na akong palakad-lakad na parang ewan so yun um, that's why uh, but I'm happy that at least even in the on the entrance I saw it and at least I know if I come back and what to, where, where I will go diba kung san, san ko siya makikita etc because it's really very very difficult here in China in Beijing in particular because people really speak English and you know you can find your way through if you don't know the language because even if you say temple of heaven they don't know it they call it Chan Chan so you know all these things and um, but of course we have to respect their own uh, preferences because they really want to preserve their own culture and their own language so what I'm saying is uh, I'm so grateful to you guys for for being with me throughout this journey uh, I'm sentimental <laughs> Okay, so thank you to my husband Maxi for the support and for all the love and for allowing me to be here to my to our children, uh, AA, Tintin, Doc Max, to Irvin, and to all my in-laws, Daisy, John, Paco, and to my grandchildren, uh, Damiel, uh, Zach, um, SJ, and of course, Langit. So, thank you very much. And to my inai, pasensya na po, hindi ko kayo naasikaso. And also to my siblings and to my um, nieces and nephews um, I'm really grateful to you all for your love and to my office mates to my boss JHM um, Agnes and to all, everyone in the office to my to my staff and you know my managers thank you very much for all the love and I to my friends friends from everywhere I have so much of them and you know all of you are uh, precious to my heart sorry nalaglag yung ano <laughs> kasi ako okay so what I'm saying is um uh, <laughs> perhaps you will ask oh my god a 57 year old traveled all the way to China alone with no equipment with no right gear and with no plans <laughs> and with no I mean with just limited knowledge of this particular region in Asia so it's just the interest of seeing the Great Wall because really that's the focal purpose that's the one of I mean, you know, sobrang pinaghandaan ko naman yun, yung Great Wall. So, it's just a bonus that yesterday there was a snow. And so, uh, I talked to someone, if a snow drops when you visit in China, you will be, uh, shall I say, pros prosperous in the coming years. And I hope I will be, and all of, of, all of us will be. So, yun, um, uh, maybe, uh, what is the recollection of uh, this particular trip? It's a long one. It has been some time that I took this trip. Um, six days? Very long. Uh, three days in, Ch in Shanghai and three days in Beijing. So I took the opportunity because it's my birthday. So at least I explored the two cities. And also because the fare is relatively very slow if, if you pass through Shanghai. So, um, uh, and I didn't regret naman passing by Shanghai because Shanghai is a city that is so vibrant, so cosmopolitan, so modern and yet they were able to retain certain heritage church, heritage buildings which I like and uh, they were able to retain certain charm and they were all be, the, one, the one that I like is the Shanghai Old Street where it's as if you're transported to the old Shanghai because of course my, my study in Oriental History says that Shanghai is you know, in fact, it's, it's an old, you know, uh, uh, Chinese uh, district. And in fact, you can just imagine how they lived there before, no? Yung, yung ganon. So, um, 
and then uh, of course I like the Bund, uh, I like the ferry experience and the Shanghai Tower and the Yuan Garden and, and the, the autumn, you know, I like it, I, I really love it. And then, um, medyo, ang ano lang doon, na-scam din ako sa taxi. And medyo nahilo ako nung first day. And it's good that there's someone who helped me. Thank you, my angel, for helping me and all that. I can't remember your name anymore, but at least you helped me and I'm so happy and God bless you. And, you know, and then, um, when I traveled to uh, Beijing, I don't have any idea that it's so difficult because uh, you need a ticket, so I should have booked the ticket. It's cheaper, but I was not that smart to book it. And you know, there's some someone like Kenny who helped me get through the airport, uh, the railway station, and uh, it's very far. And yet, nakapasok ako, nakasakay ako sa bullet train. That's another experience. Imagine um, a location that is used to be traveled in 12 hours by train. We traveled it only in less than four hours. So it's so fast, and it's really a bullet train and you feel comfortable as if you're in the airplane so and then of course in Beijing uh, it's good that I started there are some challenges haha <laughs> na capture ang ano tapos hindi ko alam yung hotel nag travel ako ng madaling araw na hindi ko alam yung district and all that but God is so good to me and God is so loving and caring and you know if there is someone like you, who anyone there who doesn't believe in God, then talk to me because I can give you affirmations that there is God and there's really that supreme being out there who always will be with you all the way. So anyway, so yon and then so I just left the hotel at around midday because my schedule, my my hotel is even not fixed. So, but then again, it was a good choice because uh, I was able to go to Tiananmen Square, to Forbidden City, to the Palace Museum. So, those three are all, you know, and the Mao Zedong um, Mausoleum. So, those four are actually the primary, one of the primary, um, shall I say, uh, uh, places of interest here in Beijing. No? So, uh, and then the second day, the second day is the best. Really, it's the It's really the best. It's really the best because, as I said, I look forward to going to Great Wall of China. And you know, God was even so kind. And you know, probably I did something good in the past that, such that you know, the snow fell yesterday. And <laughs> wow, going to the mountains in, with the snow, with all the trees covered with snow, <sighs> it's a different experience. Um, I can't speak, explain it. <laughs> anyway, so yon. Uh, nasa ano ko naman, nasa mga videos ko naman. But you know, I met some Malaysians there, and then uh, the Kluk Travel was kind enough to fix, fetch me from the airport. I followed what they said. It'd be at the hotel lobby at 6:30. I was there, ready, primed up. But you know, uh, apparently my hotel is not that known, and you know, <laughs> malayo siya sa ano sa parang assembly point so anyway so yon the best my gosh we had a great lunch we had um, the, the, the the Malaysian people are okay and then all the people there are okay and then I met a Malay an Indonesian who took the pictures of me in in ano and then I was in the cable car with the Chinese family so all this my god although nadulas ako <laughs> Nadulas talaga ako, you know, I sleep in the snow, so it's okay because, um, ano naman, um, it's part of the experience because it's really slippery. So, yun, uh, I, I, I am now, ito, yung third day actually is, uh, parang, in fact, last night I planned to even go back to the Philippines, but then, uh, I said na maybe I should take some time to rest, so, I take some time to rest and um, I, uh, you know, possibly I got what I deserve because yun nga, nawala ako 
because this is really what I want to see the Temple of Heaven and then um, probably Lama Temple and then Jingxiang Park yun yung mga hindi ko napuntan which is okay uh, so yun uh, and then I got to go to uh, Wang Fuji so yun at least nakita ko naman siya kung ano yung Wang Fuji <laughs> so yun guys uh, have a blessed um, shall I say nako isa lang talaga yung ano kasi yung, yung ano ko eh, kailangan ng isang kamay ko ng ano, ano ba yun fingerprint so anyway uh, hi bye bye have a blessed uh, Tuesday afternoon I'll see you tomorrow in Manila and I love you guys Merry Christmas and happy birthday to me so wish me a lot and just pray for me I'm okay and give me love and give me hope and you know give me um, strength to carry all the burdens and challenges of life which I think everyone has none so yeah thank you very much thank you I love you Maxi Ma Ma